If ever there was a middle of nowhere, then the spot chosen to locate South Africa's Mammoth Solar Park would fit the description perfectly. A monument to the country's drive for meaningful renewable or green power, the park is destined to become the world's biggest such endeavor. What does this mean? This means that South Africa will soon begin building the world's biggest solar park. It is a leap of faith in the power of the sun for renewable clean energy that will go a long way towards reducing the country's current power shortages and is expected to cut costs as well. This topic has piqued your curiosity, hasn't it? So to satisfy that curiosity, you are in the right place. Welcome back to the Genesis Channel. Today we're back together and talking about Africa as a place where a huge field of mirrors will be built to produce green energy. We'll continue the video soon, but before that, you know what we always remind you of? Only three clicks, like, subscribe, and the notification bell. Now let's start. The project will see the construction and operation of a concentrating solar thermal power, CSP, plant in the Hay District, around 30 kilometers from Postmasburg in the Northern Cape. A CSP tower plant generates solar power using mirrors known as heliostats to concentrate a large area of sunlight onto a small area known as the receiver. Electricity is then generated when the concentrated light is converted to solar thermal energy. It will be capable of producing approximately 480 gigawatt hours net of renewable energy annually, with a nominal net generating capacity of approximately 100 megawatts. The project sponsors are ACWA Power and Solar Reserve. ACWA Power is a developer, investor, co-owner, and operator of a portfolio of power generation and desalinated water production plants with operations in 12 countries in the Middle East and North Africa, Southern Africa, and Southeast Asia regions. ABSA, which is involved in the funding and development of the project, has previously said that the Redstone CSP project will have 12 hours of full load energy storage. This will enable the power plant to reliably deliver a stable electricity supply to more than 200,000 South African homes during peak demand periods, even after the sun has set. The solar park will create around 12,300 construction jobs and more than 3,000 operations and maintenance jobs. It will be built in stages over nine years. The park brings together an array of solar generation systems, including photovoltaic PV, concentrated PV, and concentrated solar power CSP using parabolic mirrors and solar tower technology. CSP, which some energy experts describe as the intermediary step between fusion and fission power generation, captures the sun as superheat and turns massive reserves of water into hyperheated steam to power energy generating turbines. Its advantage is that it is cost-effective, efficient, easily localized, and can store heat. The park will also encourage the manufacture of the components of solar power electricity generation, including photovoltaic cells, film and mirrors, tubes, pipes, valves, pumps, and steel fabrication. Solar electricity generation is an attractive proposition for emerging economies because of the generous measure of component manufacture that can be undertaken locally. Localization in these drops or villages in the middle of nowhere is becoming a well-used buzzword. Homegrown entrepreneurs are gearing up to meet the growth and sustainability needs of the region's fledgling electricity generating sector. In this regard, the park has massive potential and could be the world's biggest solar power localization program when the hosting of dozens of sun-associated factories becomes a reality. South Africa's energy landscape is rocky and difficult to navigate. However, it seems that exactly this landscape is necessary for Africa to produce electricity, which is very important for the country. Imagine how much easier life will be for residents, especially those in villages that may not have had electricity until now. Africa is recovering and will contribute a lot to the world, especially now that it will have the largest field of mirrors in the world. What do you think about it? Have you heard of this idea of producing electricity before? We'd like to know your thoughts, opinions, and criticisms too, so please be kind and write them down in the comments section. One more thing, if you haven't done so at the beginning of the video, then now is the right time to click subscribe and turn on the notifications to never miss more videos like this one. Share the video on your social media with your friends. Maybe they will also start following mega projects around the world. If you enjoyed the video, and we hope you did, then please smash that like button. That's it for today. 
We're preparing more great videos for you, so we'll meet again soon.